Hey guys, welcome back to Gajin Garage. What are we doing this morning? We put in those headers and those so Hit like, hit share, subscribe. As you can see, she has this uh, naughty, naughty aftermarket headers, and we're gonna put cool headers on them. Come through, she got come through all the way back. I do have my drone out here, charging them. I haven't played with it for almost a year now. So, I was gonna do some air, air um, shots. So, got that one running. Look at the cars out here, the truck, the Lex, S2000, the CRX is already here. And the Acura, the CRX is getting, you know, it doesn't even stretch its like that much. So I got them here charging up, running it. This, you know, last time I used this, we, me and Jordan, I went to West Palm, we were calling it over there. And uh, we did a nice trip all the way out there in this car. So I'm like, figured let it run for a while, let the battery charge. And uh, we have my son's DSX right here. Nice wheel sitting there, chilling. Let's go. So, this is my household right here. So, guys, uh, Toyota is for sale. I got some stuff coming up. Some, I got some parts coming up for that car. So, you can see we're going to change the logo to original back to Toyota. But today, we're working on this uh, CRX. Well, the also. Hit like, hit, share, subscribe. You can remember the Del Sol when it came to us? The Del Sol didn't have this wheel, they had the black wheels. They didn't have those tail lights. You had the oh, uh, this aftermarket ugly ass tail lights on them. We it ran out find these and put them on. She does have the JDM um, covers that we haven't put on yet. Um, we uh, she replaced the carpet inside, do the steering wheel thing, you know, make it look more nice out here, and then. He, he bought, she bought new ponies, she bought new uh, rotors, pads, and, and cut back the sauce, lower control arm. She, she did a lot to this car, guys. Follow up if you want to see more about this car. She's done so much stuff on this car, keep doing more stuff. Now, we have the header. She also replaced the VTEC uh, OEM box cover with a VTEC. This is like a 93. She put that on. She's this came with a vehicle. And uh, I don't know where Connor's going flying with it. Hey, you realize this has got an e brake, just not gonna roll back, right? I, I usually know it. <laughs> <laughs> um, she also got this from um, I told her to shine them up. Well, so creation sent us these straight right away. You can see the video on that. Um, she still got a okay battery. Um, so we put this eBay soft system all the way through. After we put this eBay soft system, give her some headaches. She does have a cat back from Comscom 2, and now she's getting this come to header that we unbox, taking apart in a minute. And then we're using for the first time my brand new Christmas jack stands. So these two gentlemen right here, this beautiful lady and this gentleman right here, they're gonna hit on it. I might just record and talk to you today. Let's open this up first. Let's open that up before you take that apart and get too crowded in here. I'll give you the option, Adriana. Oh, you found it, huh? There you go. Here goes this unboxing. He's going to take it apart. So, I haven't seen the headers, how they look online or anything. And that is the header name and um, there we go we're gonna rip it apart there we go dun, 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 dun. oh she got cut oh the big box for this little thing oh those are cool okay lift it up in there so you can see them take it apart this is tiny I know see the difference <laughs> Yeah. That's gonna look cool. So guys, look at this. This is what it looks like a regular now nah, watch this. Those are the warranty by the way. Yeah. That's a soft flange in case you have to cut it and make a new one. Mm -hmm. That goes in the end. So there was no more padding or anything in there. Huh? Just... <laughs> yeah, just bouncing up there. 
You know that knife, you can use it. Man. Oh, you got it? Okay. You know, I found that in the car that I bought one time. Yeah, I know. <laughs> Yo, shake those headers out. What? This is gonna look sick. That's the ultra sensor. You should have another one around by your arm. Nice pressure. Huh. Right there. So the reason we're going with that, she already has the uh, come back to Sasu, but when we put these headers on, we noticed the car started giving like turning off on her and everything. We did everything, we checked all the sensors and everything. The car still is doing that. So we're gonna replace this with that. We replaced the other two sensors twice in the car thinking they were bad on us. But when you guys buy stuff OEM from uh, I'm not OEM but from Tom too, look for that label right there, baby. That's the label for them. That's the original product for them. All right, so Adriana, do you see that? Open it up, I wanna show you something. Is that a test kit? No. This, come here, I'm moving. What's in here? You see that? This, now it goes in here. Wait, did it not come with the gas? That usually is in case the other side mm -hmm. doesn't have one of these like this. Oh. You attach that to that, see? Okay. And boom, you make it, all right? So now you can put that back in the box and then start taking it apart. That's the other two, other two sensor on top. Yeah. So what we're gonna need for that, okay, if you're gonna let me go through, is you have, you're gonna need this. And we are gonna need, I don't know. Yo, welcome to my mess over here. Go ahead, use whatever you have to use. I'm not just gonna record. So. You don't worry about that right now. Don't worry about that one. Wait, and did it not one. come with the gasket? No. Nope. You can use that one. Oh yeah, I thought it, I bought it. It said that it had it too. Yeah, it came with the gasket in the back. Oh. It never came with a top gasket. Well, yeah, guys. Um, so she's all 90% stock on the engine bay, as you can see. This is something that came with the car that she still haven't changed it yet, but she's looking for something better. Um, we got two O2 sensor right there. That's one right here that we're gonna have to use that tool that I just put on the floor. Okay. You're gonna use that, and then you're gonna go underneath, and then you have another one, it should be right on top, or okay. on the side. And if you need that light down there, we have light down there. And these are 12 millimeters all the way around. Okay. Hey guys, so welcome back. So, what's going on? So the new headers, the mouse piece is a little bit bigger. My neighbor across the street, he does well doing his truck a lot. I said, hey man, can you help me out? So he took it away from me, put two hours finally, but then rain come down. And the rain continued coming down, I had to bring in the, the Integra, I mean Integra, the other car here at the food floor the street. Anyway, that's that. Now, so we decided because we were gonna be waiting for a while. We're gonna do the oil pan that we've been looking for a while. We're gonna do that. We're also gonna do the compressor. It's right there. And the condenser for this car. And the compressor here for that. So we're gonna do that for now. Waiting on them and him. So we're gonna do that. So stay tuned so we can do this. All right, guys. So you guys want to get. I forgot some time to So I'm going to get it. I am draining the oil pan gas here right now. Doing two things, but it's draining the oil paint. Waiting for that to go through, and after that, I'm gonna grab it. I'm gonna take it apart, and I'm gonna take the safety bolt, the, the transmission plate off. It's missing a bolt already, and I'm gonna take these three off. Then I'm gonna take all these out. Take the oil pan and that to get washed, 
And then when you come back, we can put a new one in, put all the all that clean up, and uh, put it back together. Then we're gonna work on the compressor, taking the bowl out, taking all that out, put the compressor back on, of course, do the fueling and waiting for the headers. Stay tuned, give me 10 minutes and we go to work. You can grow one of these magnets, you're gonna put it on the oil. You're gonna run out of the bottom. Right? If you see nothing there, haha, this motor's solid. But I do have something here though. I'm gonna move this back. Okay. I have something on my fingers, man. I do have a little piece of metal here. That's it. You know, this car has a lot of oil, a lot of mileage on it. But now, this right here, that's the bigger problem right there. Look, that's cracked. That was leaking. Take it apart. You gotta clean it up. All right, guys, so the oil pan is clean. That part is clean. Now we're waiting on basically the, the oil pan gaskets, put it on, and put the oil on and all that stuff. In the meantime, I am going to continue moving on. I'm going to take this apart, waiting for them to arrive. And then talking about the devil, they're right there. So now we're going to do. He's gonna hear that we're gonna, we're gonna try to put it out together. And I'm gonna start taking all the apart. Number 10 right here, number 10 right there. Then I get this apart, then I'm gonna take this apart, bring it out, put the new one on, and get it going. All right, guys, so we had been working, the guys have been working hard on this. The oil pan is done. You remember the sequence is only nine pounds to do that. And then do the sequence, the 18, the 18, 
bolts in there, so you have to do a sequence on that. Colin right now is he's doing the oil uh, grain plug. Of course, we use the Honda filter for this. And after that, we're gonna fill it up. The next step, so the condenser that we had was for the 99 Civic, 94, and 6 Civic, 98. It's different, so we didn't have one. So we ordered one. So what we're gonna do, we're gonna put the compressor, we're gonna take the bell out, and we're not gonna touch nothing, so it's hard. But also, the clip, this clip right here, the clip the condenser, the previous owner cut it and made some rigs over there. So I'm gonna go to the junkyard on Wednesday, and I'm gonna cut one, and bring it home, and we, when we have the time, we can redo it. And then the condenser thing, I'll go to the thing that we're waiting on, Put the headers on, just put them right, right across the street. When he finished, you can bring it to me and I can put it on the car and I'll be set. So, besides that, guys, that's what we're doing. We're on that. Guys, it's late at night. We have the finally the part on. Check those headers out. That looks pretty nasty. I like them. It's down there. Built in the last end, so this lady can go to work tomorrow. Uh, that was a nice pipe down there. See, when you're young and not fat like I am, you fit everywhere. <laughs> That was a nice tight though. Tight fit. Oh yeah. You put the old two sensor back on? Yeah. I like it. I like those more than the other one. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I'm serious. They look like it fit perfectly on the car. Tensioner. Oh, the tensioner is loose? Yeah, that's why it's metal coming down. Here. Um, get the light so we can see what we're doing. Yeah. I tighten it or not? No, no, you cannot tighten it. It's no, it's the one, the oh, one yeah, there. Yeah, take the whole tensioner out? Yeah, because it's what he's doing right now is hitting the, this is what he's doing right here, look. It's hitting ah. the bolt. Something hitting there is right there on the, Oh yeah! All right, guys. We finally finished the headers, and that looks amazing. Thank you, Colin over there. He did that for, for Adriana, and I help out, you know. But that looks great. Now she's gonna turn it on. Clean, clean the garage up. I'm gonna move the CRX. That car looks amazing, guys. Thumbs up, hit like, and share if you like this. And she's gonna hear the car run. So I move the Sierra. Break on. 
No, I'm trying to figure it out once when you have power on the vehicle, that's happening. See? It's only when she gets to hit the power, the problem she has it. Or oh, the hoses are vibrating. Before it vibrates, you can hear the a soft vibrating. You can hear all that stuff before. Go ahead. So now, yeah, now you don't hear nothing. guys you've heard that you didn't even see me in the camera but that car just got way louder wong, wong. yeah you can hear it right I need to send it <laughs> she's getting by, by the end of the block right now I think surprisingly quick right side well yeah we open it up <laughs> yeah, yeah. Woo. So guys, from here, a goodbye to my helper for the day. Right there. So follow up, hit like, hit share, subscribe. I hope you like this video. Thumbs up, guys. It's about seven, eight o'clock right now. We started this about nine o'clock in the morning, but we were waiting for my neighbors. Thank you. Gracias por todo lo que me ayudaste. Because I know you watched my channel. So this is it. Good night. See you later. And I can hear her coming now. Peace out.